everybody, Mark Brown here, Chief Demo Pilot of Daher Aerospace, the Kodiak Division. I'm standing here in the Idaho backcountry in front of our 2021 Kodiak 100 Series 3 demonstrator aircraft. Today I want to talk about something that comes standard on all Kodiak 100 Series 3s, and it's the pitch latch propeller. The pitch latch propeller is a, a different kind of propeller for a PT-6. What a pitch latch propeller is, is it allows the airplane to be shut down in the beta position like we see here. Most PT-6s are shut down in a feathered position. Uh, and why the pitch latch is important, especially on an airplane like the Kodiak, is a, a few reasons. First and foremost is for seaplanes. So when you're on the water, you don't have brakes. And so the propeller, when it goes from normal pitch when the air engine is running to being shut down, when it goes into that feather position, it actually creates thrust. Well, on water, you don't want that thrust when you're shutting down as you go in towards a dock or a beach or some, some other way uh, to park the plane. And same when you start up. When you start up out of feather, you create thrust. So on floats, uh, the pitch latch propeller is vital. And as, as most know by now, every Kodiak 100 is designed from the factory to be put on floats. There's no structural or aerodynamic upgrades that have to be made to the plane when it goes on the aeroset floats. So the pitch latch propeller allows the airplane uh, to, to do that. But a lot of people don't realize the pitch latch propeller can also be really important on an airstrip like this. In the backcountry where there's a lot of grass and fod and things that could get sucked up into the engine. So when, the, when you start the aircraft up in feather, you're actually creating a bit of a, a vortice, almost like a mini tornado below the propeller that can actually suck dirt and debris up and potentially cause it to go in the engine. Now the Kodiak has our famous 19 inches of prop clearance. Our inlet is way up here. So it's, it's very unlikely in a Kodiak that's designed to be a bush plane to have those problems, but it's never a non-issue. And so what the pitch latch propeller allows you to do is basically start the engine up and have immediate thrust. So you're never standing in one place waiting for the prop to come out of feather to create thrust and you have those few seconds where you could potentially pick up fog. So it, it's really an important uh, tool not only on floats but also on uh, backcountry strips like this. So that's a little bit of an overview of the pitch latch propeller on the Kodiak 100 Series 3. So now that you guys know why the pitch latch propeller is important, let's hop inside the cockpit and I'll show you guys how it's a little bit different starting it up. And we'll walk through a startup and a shutdown procedure. All right guys, to start the Kodiak 100 in pitch latch, it's really simple. It's just like every other start sequence. We turn our master and avionics on. All the avionics are up and running. All our engine gauges are here. Our enunciators are here. Then what we do is we turn our ignition on, turn it on, make sure we hear it, make sure our enunciator comes on. Turn the fuel pump to standby, double check, make sure the um, enunciator comes on, also make sure you can hear it, and then turn it to on for start. And then we're gonna hold the starter in low, and that gets the prop spinning. At 15% NG, we bring in uh, fuel to low idle, and you'll see the RPM on the prop goes up really quickly. In feather, it would just kind of stay below this yellow arc here, but um, it, it goes real quickly up, and basically it allows us, as soon as we start the engine, to get power either forward or backwards almost immediately after start. So here we go, we'll start it up. Here it comes up, there's 15%. We'll bring it into low idle. I'm monitoring ITT, it's a really cool starting engine. There's the prop coming up super quick. There's 52%. Lift off the starter, the starter's engaged, bring it back into feather and then up into idle. And it's started and it's out of pitch latch. And again, I have immediate control either forwards or backwards. So on floats, extraordinarily important because as soon as you get the engine started, you can either go into, into beta and reverse to go backwards or you can go into power and go forwards. You have that immediate power uh, when it comes out of the, off the latches. So now that we're inside the airplane, we're gonna, uh, I'll teach you guys how to do a shutdown in pitch latch. So as we talked about outside the plane, 
The pitch latch propeller on floats and on wheels can be really convenient uh, for certain phases of flight or certain conditions when you're shutting the airplane down. So it's really simple to, to shut it down in pitch latch. Basically, we're going to turn all the lights off like we normally would do on shutdown. Fuel pump box uh, off, auxiliary bus, generator, alternator off. We'll get a couple enunciators, that's normal. And then what we do is we just bring the uh, power lever back down a little bit into a uh, beta. That allows those locks to engage. And then we bring the fuel to cut off as we're in beta and we just leave it like that. That allows those locks to, to keep the prop keep the prop in, uh, in beta as opposed to going down into feather like most PT6s do. So it's as simple as that.